Hello everyone, welcome to D4 Drupal channel. Today we are going to see about how to query spell check in Apache Solar. So first, uh, here you have an option to enable a spell check. So once the spell check is enabled, you will be having an option called build. This will uh, create a new spell check directory for you. So when you want to use, you can use it. This is a flag and this is a reload. So it will reload or refresh your uh, spell check directory. If you want to use any particular directory name, you can use the directory name here. You can use uh, by default, it will use default. And uh, there is an, one more directory called word break. So whatever you are configuring in your solar config.xml, all those directory will be used here. And next one is so spell check query. So spell check is nothing but when you uh, misspell some words in your search page, it will be giving you the suggestion. Did, did you mean this like that? So that is what spell check. So you have to pass a query here. So I already have a URL listed here. When you use spell check, you should not pass a Q parameter and all. So when you scroll up and see, you can see here it is passing Q parameter and all. So spell check, you have to pass only spell check parameter when you run it. So spell check Q values channel and then uh, spell check is enabled. So the value for these two we are passing. One is spell check enabled and spell check Q. We both, we are passing these two. So we are passing channel instead of channel. So it is giving suggestion for you as channel. Okay. So, and then... Uh, the next option what we have here is spell check count. So spell check count is uh, how many spell check count you want to display. So if it is displaying for a suggestion and you want to restrict it, that time you can use this count. You can see now we are having suggestion for only two for doll. So when you want to, uh, when you remove this, you can see actual how many suggestions the solar is providing. So actually it is providing around four spell check. Okay. So that is what a uh, spell check count. And this, the most popular uh, hit item will be suggested first. That is what this is a flag. And the extended feature, this will give uh, some extra result for your suggestion. In your Apache solar, like here we are having frequency, you know. Like that, it will give extra uh, result, extended result. And next one is collation. So collation means collation will give you the uh, collaborative result. Like uh, now we enable the spell check collation here. When you paste it here, you can see it is uh, giving suggestion for doll. For doll, we have suggestion of del, dual, data, date. And for Vida screen, we are having suggestion of white screen. And Altrisheep, we are having a suggestion for Altrisheep as ultra shop. And next is collation. So what is collation? Collation, combination of all those words. If there is any suggestion, those will be added. So we have Dell white screen, ultra shop, dual white screen, ultra shop, data white screen, ultra shop, date white screen, ultra shop. So this is what collation is doing here. And then next we have a option called max collation. So maximum how many collation it should respond to you. So currently it is having four collation right here. One, two, three, four. So when you want to restrict this to one, it will be displaying only one collation. When you change this to two, it will display only two collation, okay? So that is what collation, uh, max collation. And next one is tries. So tries, tries will try that much collation if it is possible. So when you scroll down, actually this have four collation, but we try to get it only three. So it is showing only three. If you give five, that time also it will respond three, four here, okay? And you give five and enter, scroll down. It is showing four. So what is the difference between max collation and uh, tries means? 
this is if you, whatever number you are giving, it will respond only that particular number of collation. If you are giving two, only two collation will be there. If you are giving three, only three collation will be there. And when you use max collation twice, when you use 10, it will uh, give you how much uh, collation available. If there are 50 collation, it will respond to only 10. If there are only eight collation, it will return you only eight collation here, okay? So that is what that option is. And next one is spell check accuracy. Spell check accuracy. So for spell check, this is the URL copy and paste it. So this represent how accurate the results should be. Like uh, if you see here, it, the number of for accurate accuracy should be zero to one. So we are passing dal, vira, screen, and then ultra sharp, right? So here we are using collation of 0 0.6. So it should be, uh, when you reduce it, you can see here doll, the suggestion is only del. It is not showing dual date at all, right? When you change this to 0 0.3, you can see it is giving more suggestion. Okay, so how accurate the result should be? You can restrict that. When you give one, it will not display anything because there is uh, no data suggestion which is equal to dot. That's it. And that's it about spell check querying in Apache Solar. And if you like the video, please share, like, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye.